a happy World Diabetes Day. India is often referred to as the diabetes capital of the world because we have the second largest number of people with diabetes in the world. We and others have done studies which have shown that one of the reasons for the rapid increase in diabetes in our country is the excess carbohydrate that we take. An average Indian, whether they live in the north, south, east, west, northeast, anywhere, consumes 65 to 75 percent of their total calories in the form of carbohydrate. As we know, carbohydrate gets converted into glucose and this is one of the reasons why, number one, the incidence rate of diabetes is increasing. And number two, for those already having diabetes, it's very difficult to control their diabetes. So what is the solution? One of the things which is missing or absent in the Indian diet is the adequacy of good quality protein. Almost in all parts of India, the protein consumption is very low. My suggestion on this World Diabetes Day would be, number one, to focus on increasing the protein content of the diet. This can be done in the form of vegetable protein like Bengal gram, green gram, black gram, soya, mushroom, milk, and many other products for vegetarians. For non-vegetarians, it's even more easy because you can have it in the form of eggs and fish, chicken, and occasionally lean meat as well. If you increase the protein content to about 20% of the diet, automatically the carbohydrate content will go down. In a recent publication we showed, based on the ICMR in diet study, that if we reduce the carbohydrate to just 50% and increase the protein and the rest of it should come from healthy fats which includes monounsaturated fats as well as the polyunsaturated fats this will help in many ways for those who have diabetes it will help to control their diabetes well number two if you have pre-diabetes this will prevent progression to overt diabetes and very often if you have pre-diabetes or early diabetes it can also help in achieving a total remission of your diabetes which means your glucose levels can become completely normal and you may not require any anti-diabetic drugs as well so the secret to a healthy diabetic diet is to increase the protein content of the diet and this will also result in an increase in the fiber content of the diet. Of course, if your doctor suggests that it is difficult for you to take natural forms of protein from the diet, he may uh, suggest to you to take a protein supplement. And there are several excellent protein supplements, uh, which are also good tasting by the way, which can be added as a supplement. This, but this of course should be decided by your doctor. So on this occasion of the World Diabetes Day, let me all wish you a long and healthy life despite diabetes and in those of you in whom it is possible to try to achieve a complete remission of your diabetes. Thank you.